Hello guys and welcome. So in this video, I wanted to answer the question, what is Until Dawn? This video is aimed at people who know nothing about Until Dawn and have always been curious. Hopefully it'll serve as a good starter guide for you. So Until Dawn is a 2015 interactive drama survival horror game developed by Supermassive Games and published by Sony Computer Entertainment for PlayStation 4. Players assume the control of eight young adults who have to survive on Blackwood Mountain when their lives are threatened. The game features a butterfly effect system in which players must take make choices that may change the story. All playable characters can survive or die depending on the choices made. Players explore the environment from a third person perspective and find clues that may help solve the mystery. The game was originally planned as a first person game for PlayStation 3 motion controller PlayStation Move. The motion controls were dropped and when it then it became a PlayStation 4 game. The story was written by uh, Larry uh, Fezen, Fezenden and uh, Graham Resnick, who sought to create the video game equivalent of a slasher film. The development team took inspiration from various sources. These include the movies Evil Dead 2 and Poltergeist, and video games Heavy Rain, Resident Evil, and Silent Hill. To ensure the game was scary, the team used a uh, galvanic skin response test to measure playtesters' fear levels when playing it. Wow. Uh, Jason Graves composed the soundtrack, and Guerrilla Games uh, Decima game engine was used for the graphics. Several noted actors, including Rami Malik, Aidan Panettiere, uh, Megan Martin, Brett Dalton, Jordan Fisher, Nicole Broom, and Peter Stormar provided motion capture and voice acting. So, um, what I'm going to do as part of this usual for my What Is series, I'm going to link as many useful resources into the description down below, including to the Wikipedia page, to the official website, to this gameplay trailer, and so on. So the choices you make throughout the game, like I said, it really does have an effect. You can get through the end of the game with pretty much everyone surviving or with no one surviving and every combination in between. It's 100% down to the choices you make in different situations. Now, when I went through the game some years ago, I think I managed to get about four people to survive. And I did try my best to save everyone, but obviously I made some wrong choices along the way. Also as well, the game is very... The graphics for the time were amazing. And uh, it is it is creepy. It does, like, all the time you're wondering, like, what the hell's going to happen. Um, if you are into this sort of experience, then great. Now, the game doesn't overly go after jump scares all the time. It, it's more like a... I would say more like a thriller than a horror movie. Uh, but still. And it is down to the choices you make. And there is some supernatural stuff happening in, t in the game as well. Uh, so it's not just down to real life, you know, th there is some creepy weirdness in the game as well. So guys, what we're now going to do, we're going to visit the official website and we're going to see what's written on there. Okay, so here's the official website, which uh, link in the description of Supermassive Games. So until dawn, PlayStation 4, when eight friends are trapped on a remote mountain retreat and things quickly turn sinister, they start to suspect they aren't alone. Gripped by fear and with tensions in the group running high, you'll be forced to make snap decisions that could mean life or death for everyone involved. Um, every choice you make in your terrifying search for answers, um, even the seemingly trivial ones, will carve out your own unique story. With a spine tingling performances from a Hollywood's cast, including Aidan Penetier, Heroes of Nashville, or the Chi leader from the TV show Heroes, um, brought to life with the power of PlayStation 4. Your actions alone will decide who survives in Until Dawn. Um, in a unpredictable and dynamically adaptive story, crafted in consultation with Until Dawn scriptwriters and indie horror um, authors, uh, Larry Fezenden and Graham Resnick, eight friends come together at a remote mountain getaway and embark upon a night of unexpected terror. Through the course of the night, anyone can live, anyone can die, and things aren't always what they seem. 
twists and turns will keep you guessing right to the end as you play each of, of the friends. The decisions you make on their behalf will determine who survives until dawn. With innovate, innovative choice mechanics and the butterfly effect interface, players can clearly see the path of their story amid the thousands that are possible. Seemingly insignificant choices as well as huge moral dilemmas that will question your sense of fairness, good and evil, can have major unforeseen consequences. So using the power of PlayStation 4 and the superior rendering capability of the Killzone Shadowfall engine, together with our own major enhancements in lighting, camera and animation systems, Until Dawn brings emotional and credible performances of a talented Hollywood cast to life in its realistically terrifying environments. So the page, it links to the official PlayStation pages. So yeah, and we have some testimonials, some screenshots, things like that. So um, as I say, guys, I did really, really enjoy this game. So I did add it to my what is list. It is a game that I really wanted to share with you all. And um, I would really recommend to try it out. It's a great game. And since then, uh, Supermassive Games have made Man of Medan. And I will do a what is video for that in the future. So, uh, yeah. So tell me in those comments down below, have you played Until Dawn? What did you think of it? How many people did you get to survive by the end? And so on. Like, do you like this style of game? I thought it was really, really good. I really, really enjoyed it. So I highly recommend this game. Anyway, guys, that's it for this video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up. You can watch around the video over there. You can watch the latest upload down there. Or you can click down here to subscribe. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye.